Hello guys, welcome back to another video, and today we're going to be reacting to some Darman videos, because I have nothing else to do in life. Not right now, but when I'm an adult, yes. But that isn't neither here nor there. Reminds me of a story of one time I went over a good picnic with my good friend. Okay, I'm just not going to start with that. Um, so yeah, we're just going to react to some Darman videos. Okay, so let's go. I'm going to drink my Coke. Now let's get watching. Wait, what? Okay, let's get watch. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Happy Yay! birthday. Happy oh, birthday. Thanks, Dad. Of course. Wait, is this strawberry? Yeah, why? Is something wrong? <sighs> I told you I wanted red velvet. Okay, first of all, no. I'm not too big of red velvet. I would rather have strawberry than red velvet. <sighs> I'm so sorry, honey. I tried, but the bakery didn't have any left. So I got you your second favorite instead. Why would I want to eat my second favorite today of all days? Be grateful. <sighs> Forget it. I guess I just won't be eating any cake on my birthday. Listen here, dumbass. You get cake on your birthday. Do you know how many homeless people there are on the streets on their birthday not getting anything? Gosh, no, I feel terrible. You feel Excuse terrible. Me. You need to learn how to get the belt. Hi, how can I help you? Uh, by chance, do you guys happen to have any, uh... I said uh, forget it, Dad. When they I actually, don't want cake anymore. When they actually had red velvet. Okay, bread. um... Never mind. Thank you. Sure. Well, I know what'll make you feel better. Here you go! A gift? <laughs> now this is more like it. Don't worry, it's just one of them. I didn't forget about what you really wanted. I still really want to learn. This better be good. <gasps> the iPhone 12? Wow. I know you wanted the new one, so... Wait, what color is this? You got me the black one. I told you I wanted the white one. You racist bastard. You are being very phonist. That's racist to the color to the color of the phone. Gee, just get a white phone case. I I know, honey, but they were all. We're not even two minutes, and I'm already all pissed off. Sold out, and, and besides, when you when you put a case on it, you won't even be able to. And it's only 128 gigs. <gasps> my 11 is 256. How am I supposed to move all my photos? Don't worry. Mm -hmm. uh, the, the guy at the store said you could store them in the cloud. You ready to go? Yeah, let's go. This is supposed Hello guys, it's me, and today we're gonna be inside a Darman video. I was gonna see my sweet her 16, and, and you're totally ruining it, Dad. I don't want this. I'll get it. Just Please leave don't. it on the ground. My dad got me the wrong phone on my birthday. Can you believe it? Well, there's a lot of people that don't get anything for their birthday. Thank you. So you should be grateful for what you have. Whatever. No one cares about your opinion. I'll take that. Thank you very much. I would have taken it. You know, honey, she does have a point. A lot of kids would be very thankful to have this. Yeah, right. Any kid who got that would be mad, too. So seriously, where's my real present? I was hoping to give that to you a little later. Why? 
Don't tell me you messed that up too. I don't know. I, I got you. I need to know what this man named his daughter. Cause she's acting like a real bitch. I guess you can have it now. Come on, let's go. Can you watch this for me? Make sure no one takes it. No. Yeah, sure. Happy birthday. Thanks. It's my daughter's birthday too. Well, hopefully your birthday's going better than mine. Uh, I I'm sorry about that. <laughs> Happy birthday. Well, where is it? <laughs> there it is. <laughs> I've been so excited to give this to you. Oh no, the car is not the present. No, the real present, the real present is a trip down to the orphanage. Ada. Yep. A brand new 2021 Porsche Cayenne SUV. I know how badly you've been wanting a new car. Listen, it's got 543 horsepower, leather seats, and it's black! I can't believe you got me a black car! <laughs> Racist bitch again. I, I don't understand. I, I thought you really wanted a Porsche. Sorry yeah, a sorry. red Porsche, not a black one. I, I'm sorry, honey. I, they didn't so have a red one. I, but it's still a brand new car. I mean, shouldn't you be grateful for that? Sorry, I would have been grateful if you got me the color I wanted. Not plus. this one. Oh. Reacting to Hey, Johnny. you know what? I have a guy that can wrap it and make it red. I'll give him a call. At most, it'll take about a week, okay? You just don't get it. Why do you think I wore a red dress today? I had a whole rouge-themed photo shoot planned for my Insta to match my car, and now I won't even get to post a pic on my birthday. <sighs> I, I didn't know that. Well, maybe we could get you a black dress. No! If I was her father, first thing... If this was a scenario with my parents, the first thing my dad would have done is get me the belt. First you get me the wrong cake, then you get me the wrong phone, and now you get me the wrong car? Ugh. Seriously, you're like the worst dad in the world. Ugh. Honey, we're taking that car on, to the don't trip be like that. down to the local Just orphanage. Leave me alone. I'll call an Uber home. Can't believe him. Here you go. Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you. Happy birthday again, sweetheart. <laughs> it looks so delicious. I'm sorry I couldn't buy you an entire birthday cake. And, and I'm sorry they only had chocolate here, right? I know strawberry is your favorite. Dad, stop. I'm grateful to have any cake at all. Thank you so much. Mm. It's so good. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Here, try a piece. Okay. So good. Yeah, it is. Mm. And don't think I forgot to get you a gift. Dad, I told you I didn't want anything for my birthday. I know it's not much. I just, after I lost my job, um, I know things have been no. tough, but uh, I wanted to get you something. The food and cake are more than enough. And you should be saving your money. <laughs> just. I'm really sorry. It's just a prepaid phone. I, I couldn't get you an iPhone. Are you kidding? I'm so lucky to have this phone. Seriously, this is too much. You should take it back. No, no. She's watching like, why isn't she mad? Why is she not screaming out of the room? No, I want you to have it. Okay, so please just take it. I'm just sorry that it that I couldn't get you something better. I just feel like a terrible father. Dad, there's so many people that don't get anything for their birthday. I'm so grateful for what I have. And for the record, you're the best dad in the world. I love you so much, honey. 
I love you too. Here, have another piece. Okay. Hey, hi, honey. I, I I spoke to my guy, and he said he's gonna try really hard to have it wrapped red by. It's okay, by... Dad. You don't need to wrap it. I don't. But I feel terrible. I I, I never realized how important having it red was to you. I I'm really sorry. No. You don't need to say sorry. I'm the one that should be apologizing. I don't understand. Where's all this coming from? I just realized something. A lot of people don't get anything on their birthday. I should have been a lot more grateful for everything that you got me. I'm really sorry. Can you please forgive me? Of course, honey. I'm so proud of you. Are you sure you don't want me to change the color? If you or a loved one is fighting type 2 diabetes or pre-diabetes... You got me a Porsche. Like, are you serious? I'm so, so grateful. I love you so much, Dad. I love you too. Hey, um, what about this iPhone? Do you still want to keep it, or...? Actually, I have a better idea. Come on. Hey, I just wanted to say I'm sorry about the way I acted earlier. And for not wishing you a happy birthday. Oh, it's all right. Actually, I wanted to give you something. Oh. I saw the phone you got earlier, and I wanted to give you this. What? Really? Yeah, I'm happy with my iPhone 11. Wow. Actually... I like the phone my dad got me. Think so. Are you sure? This is like a thousand dollar phone. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, well, I heard you like strawberry cake. Would you guys at least come and have some birthday cake with us? <laughs> yeah, sure, we'd love to. <gasps> Great. This is my dad, by the way. He's also the best dad in the world. There can be only one. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Think I can get this new wolf pack hoodie? That gamer girl? Video games aren't for girls. Well, that was a fun one. Right. Let's go on to the next one. Yeah. Barbie? Yeah, honey. Aren't you excited? No. Well, Can't you see from the look on my PlayStation 5? Oh my god. I can't believe it. Oh, well, we know how badly you wanted it. <laughs> but that's what I wanted. Does it come with two controllers? Uh -huh. <laughs> Don't be silly, Sam. Video games aren't for girls. That's not true. My favorite YouTuber is Sniper Wolf. She started gaming when she was just seven years old. It's my dream to be a gamer. Just like her. Sniper Wolf, what kind of name is that? Metal Gear Solid. This is what you should be playing with. Zach, you can't tell me what I can and Let's can't go. do. Thank you so much, Mom and Dad. Sniper on the roof. Drop an airstrike. Oh, she snatched it. Hey, what are you doing playing on my PS5? Give me my controller back. Hold on, there's only six people up. He's low health. Down. Give me that. Hey. Mom, mom. Snitch. What's going on? Sam took my PS5 and she won't give me back my controller. Well, you're grounded. Yeah, go to the corner. No, not you. No, no, not her. You. Why? You're like, what, 16 years old? What the hell are you snitching for? Sam, I told you, video games aren't for girls. Give him back his controller right now. But I'm about to win. Fine. Let's see. 
And I wish my parents quite did that. The guy was a camper see, anyway. I told you camper video games anyway. are for girls. I better not see you playing anymore. Here you go, Zach. <laughs> oh, how cute is this? You can wear it when you go back to school. I don't like dresses. Okay. Actually, do you think I can get this new wolf pack hoodie? Please, please. Sniper Wolf just came out with it. That gamer girl? I already told you, video games aren't for girls, so forget about it. But mom, please, it's my dream to become a- Not another word, young lady. Now, I've got to get the rest of these bags, so you can play with this while you wait here. Can you get me a good toy? I want to play with Barbies. Oh my gosh! I'm so sorry. That's okay. Why'd you kick this? I was just mad because I want to be a girl gamer. But my mom says girls can't play. The moment you realize you meet your eyes. <gasps> oh my gosh! Sniper Wolf? Hi! So, your mom says girls can't what? Oh my gosh, Sniper Wolf, you are like my idol. You are going to hell. For what? God is your only idol. No one else. You'll commit sin. Sorry, I'm freaking out right now. I can't believe it's you. Okay. My mom I says girls can't play video games. I see God. <gasps> she wants me to play with Barbies instead. That sucks. But honestly, I was always told the same thing growing up. You were? Yeah. But I never let that stop me. If boys can do something, then so can girls. There's no reason why girls can't be gamers. I'm incapable of anything. You're so right. I can be a girl gamer. But... What's wrong? <laughs> I don't have a system. And my brother won't let me play with his. Because he's selfish. Tell you what. You can have the one I just bought. <laughs> what, really? Yeah. Just promise me that you'll never give up. And by the way, it's just gamer. What do you mean? <laughs> you don't call guys boy gamers, right? So no need to say girl gamers. It's just gamer. You blew my mind out of its logic. I never thought about it that way. Thanks, Cyberwolf. And when you explain it like that? I'll never forget this. I still don't know what you're talking about. I hope to see you at the top one day. Yeah, I hope I reach my sub goal. I gotta move. The circle's closing. And Papa New UAV. Sam, what are you doing? Speak English! You know how I feel about this. Just wait, Mom. I'm about to win. Oh, here we go again. How many times do I have to tell you girls can't play video games? How many times do I, have I don't to even tell know you how you got one, up. but after you lose, I'm taking away your PlayStation. What kind of a yes, what got kind him. Of a mother are you? There's only one person left. There he is. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Just turns off the Wi-Fi. Ha! My PlayStation now. believe that Sam just won and as time goes on future nursery rhyme artist Sam starts to win more and more and what's with, what's with the narration I never get in Darman's videos with his narration like whenever like he talks in narration it, it's it's always like this I can't, can't believe that, that Sam, Sam just won. won. And, and as time, time goes, goes on, on, 
Sam starts to win more and more. The mom starts to realize that maybe girls can be gamers. A while later, Sam even gets offered an official spot on a popular esports team. That happens to also include a big advance payment. Her family couldn't be any more proud of her. And then one day, Sam even starts streaming. Hey guys. Like, what was, what's with that narration? Thanks for joining me, and today's live stream, I've actually got my mom joining me. <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm Sam's mom. Illegal information! And Psychomantis. Alright, give what? a headphone one. That's my gamer name. I'm gonna go my bad, and I'll be expecting I am so proud of Psychomantis, so, and she showed me that girl gamers can be really successful. Thanks, Mom. And no need to say girl gamer. It's just gamer. Okay, guys, we're about to hop in in Warzone, but before we get into that, I just want to say we're about to hit our 5K sub goal, and I just want to say- 5K? I need my 100 sub goal. Well, I did mention in another video, but can you guys please help me get to 100 subscribers? My goal is to hit 100 subscribers before 2022, and I would appreciate it if I could. If only I was privileged enough. Hey, Darman fam, I... Okay, we're not getting into that. <clears throat> How about this one? This will probably This past year has been different. And even though we've all been working differently, it turns out. Leah, what are you doing at this park on a illegal information? In Tuesday afternoon. What do you mean park? Wow, you're exposing us. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. We're here at Darman Studios. Darman Part exposed. three of our collab with Sniper Wolf. Uh, Are you excited Darman, for this one? Darman got exposed. <coughs> Darman got exposed. <laughs> That's very exciting. Nice. And as tradition, we're... Yeah? Okay, sorry about that. We're going to be giving away two brand new Apple laptops. All you have to do is subscribe to my channel, subscribe to Sniper Wolf's channel, and then comment done in each of our videos. we start today's video? Yeah, let's do it. All right, I'm let's go ahead and start it. My parents called me. <laughs> uh, I'm so sorry, Bree. Are you trying to be funny, Jordan? No. I didn't mean to do that. I was just trying to throw it in the trash. Really? All right, then. Let me help you throw it in the trash. <laughs> Since you are trash, Jordan. Nice one. Let's go. Yeah. Get it? Because Jordan begins with janitor. What did I just say? Yeah. Jordan the janitor. I can also say Bree the bit. You have to be so mean. You know, it must be so embarrassing having to clean floors between classes because your mom is so poor. <laughs> hey, don't talk about my mom. And besides, you shouldn't judge someone until you walk in their shoes. I'll talk about whoever I want to talk about. Oh, I can do the same thing. Oh. So I look at Brie. Hmm. How can I say this offensive? Look at that nose shape. Jordan the janitor. <laughs> <laughs> Jordan the janitor. That's so good. And besides, why would I want to walk in your nasty shoes? He smells. Let's go. Yeah. Ew. Sniper wolf? She's gonna be at her school today. Yeah. 
You didn't know? She's coming after school with Psycho Mantis. Ooh. Yo! I heard Sniper Wolf just got here. Let's go outside and look. <sighs> that was a close one. Thanks again for doing this meet and greet. Sorry, I didn't think it'd get this crazy. Oh, it's totally fine. Wait, isn't that... Jordan? What are you doing just as a janitor? I picked up a job to help my mom with rent. I know it's so embarrassing. Hold on. No. I gotta do something real quick. No, it's not. It's okay, I'm actually back. really cool. Yeah, like I used to work at a store folding clothes. There's no shame in hard work. <laughs> I wish that was true. There's this girl, Bree. She just humiliated me in front of all the school. You're joking. Bree? Someone should call her parents. Why don't you change her name? Oh no, I think they're coming. This baby for me see you. Thanks, Jordan. Hey, um, have you seen Sam or Snipe Wolf? No, I haven't. <laughs> My kidnapping plan works. Oh. Oh. Whoops. I missed. <laughs> Can you leave me alone? I'm just trying to get my work done. Oh. He's just trying to get his work done. Now I feel bad. Here, I'll help you. Oh, my hands are dirty. Wow. Thanks, Pri. I... Clean this. Jordan the janitor. <laughs> That's so good. Why would you do that? <laughs> What's the big deal? It's your job to clean, isn't it? Oh, you're right. So I should clean your ass out of here. How would you feel if I did that to you? <laughs> I wouldn't know. My mom's rich, so I'll never have to work a day in my life. That I'm like, your mom. Lazy. <laughs> have fun cleaning this up, loser. <laughs> Sam. Actually, not Simp. Simp is super intense Minecraft play. Hey, Jordan. What do you want now? Quick. The toilet's clogged. <laughs> oh, I'm actually off the clock. Aw. Alright, I'll tell you what. You make like six bucks an hour? Here's 50 cents for some of your time. Now go clean the toilet, Jordan the janitor. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, Bree? I used to be a bully, too. You see... <gasps> Look, there's Sniper Wolf! <laughs> Just kidding. I accidentally knocked over your water bucket. <laughs> you better clean this up. How about you do it? Bree Elizabeth Johnson. <laughs> I Mom, called the cops. What are you doing here? I heard how you've been treating Jordan. How could you act like that? What heard from who? Recyclable! Hey friends! Let's go outside so we can hang out. Come on. <laughs> this woman gets in the and what she deserves. like it if somebody treated you that way you should never judge someone until you have walked in their shoes <laughs> you're joking right we have money okay i would never be a janitor that's gross 
There is no shame in hard work. <laughs> you know what? That's the problem. You have never done hard work a day in your life. That's gonna change. What are you talking about? You, my dear, are going to be a janitor. So you know how it feels. And you can start by cleaning up this mess you made. What? No, Mom, there's no way I'm gonna do that. You don't have a choice. Ooh. It's either that or you are grounded the entire summer. Take my chances with summer. Come on, Jordan. Let's go hang out with Sniper Wolf. Oh, so dumb. Bree can't, can't believe, believe what just this happened. Ha okay, I'm gonna stop. The next day, Bree has to clean the floors in between classes. She gets what he deserves. One of the students comes and throws their garbage at her, laughing and calling her names. Son of the bird. Bree is so embarrassed. During lunch, while Bree is picking up the trash, another student dumps their entire tray on the floor. All the kids laugh and stare. Bree gets completely humiliated. And after school, while Bree is mopping the floor, one of her classmates comes and dumps the entire bucket of water for her to clean up. The whole school can't stop laughing. Bree's so embarrassed and finally what understands what she made Jordan feel like. And then one day, Bree happens to see Jordan. Here you go. 186. Hmm. No, it's not much, but... It's more than I make a year. Oh, honey. I am so proud of you. This is going to help more than you'll ever know. Mom, can you give me a cook set? I'll be right back. Okay. Time to give this girl what she deserves. <gasps> I'll help you. Please don't hit me with that. Hit you with just it. Why would I do it's that? It's just a prank, bro. I told you. Because of how I treated you. Look, I just wanted to say that I'm sorry. I never should have judged you before walking in your shoes. Never knew how hurtful it was to be made fun of. Can you please forgive me? Of course. Come on. I'll help you finish. <laughs> hey guys, I hope you love that message about how you should never judge somebody until you've walked in their shoes. I love that. I hope you guys love this message. And please, please remember, we're not just telling stories. We're changing lives. <laughs> we'll see you in the next video. Bye. Okay, well, that was that. So, yeah, that was a whole bunch of Darman videos. Well, only three. Leave me alone. Um, that we reacted to. And, yeah. Um, if you'd like to see any more, um, videos, um, please leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and comment down below what you would like to see. Okay? Thanks for watching, and bye! Bye. Why can't I just say, you know, I'm going to do that. A regular bye. Goodbye.